Hey, it's Kevin from JJ Hat Center. Today we're going to talk a little bit about the most iconic, best-selling, most classic, biggest models of Stetson Western hats that there are. Uh, I'm selling them here at JJ Hat Center in New York for 25 years, a little more, and uh, I'll let you know the biggest sellers, the ones that we always have because they're classics, and um, let's get started. <laughs> start a little bit I think with the Rancher. The Rancher comes in all models from like a 4X Rancher. There's even a Wool Rancher I think, but the 4X is the, you know, the basic rabbit. The 6X is a little wider. Instead of three and a half, it's a four inch brim and it's better better felt. You know, a rabbit and beaver, a touch more beaver, the 6X. The 10X is, you know, like a lot of beaver in there and stuff. It's much thicker, way softer. Um, finish has a velvety finish, better than my self bands. Um, they even call it 10x beaver inside, where the other ones just say like 4x, 6x. But when it gets a 10, it says 10x beaver on it. Then there's 20x, 30x, 40x, 100x. Um, somebody asked me if I think they're worth it. I mean, you know, there are fest Fender Custom Shop strats that are brand new strats, copies of like 60s ones that, you know, they. They retail at like five grand or more. Are they worth it? I mean, if you have the money, I guess it's cool, but to be honest, I think when they get to 10X, 10X, 20X, they don't really feel very different after that. There's not a heck of a lot of difference. They, they feel soft and velvety to the texture. They have a nice sharp edge. They get this kind of like fine, yet very hard and sharp, razor sharp edge. Um, but the 10X has it, the 20, the 30, the 100, they all have it in the higher ones. So personally, you know, I say if we, we ordered the 10, it's like $450 at our shop, and that's, that's expensive enough, you know, blowing 500 bucks, you know, with tax or whatever. Um, have, um, actually, no tax if you're doing mail order. Um, and right now they're 20% off, which is like, you know, it's $90 off. It's like almost like, what is that, 360 or something? That's a great discount. Um, the Tycoon, we call it. The Tycoon is an incredible hat. I would say that one is the Rancher Deluxe. That's the 10X version, and it's incredible. It's a little bit fancier band, like a self, self band. The band is made out of felt. A little kind of a blingy diamond gold kind of a buckle thing, just like the 100X has. But the price is, you know, 360 on sales, much more, you know, it's in control. It's not out of control. The price of the 100X is way different. Um, it's four figures, and we're not talking low four figures, so it's expensive. So I'm going to say the Rancher is definitely number one. Let me see if I can find a find a Rancher here. And show you some pictures. I'm sure you know what it is. It's James Dean, Roy Rogers, uh, the Marlboro Man, although he wore a resisto, it's a rancher style. Um, definitely in here. Let me see. Say the rancher is definitely number one. 
Um, after that, I'm going to say, you know, the uh, the high-end ranchers, same category, like the Tycoon, the 100X, El Presidente, um, El Patron. If you look up El Presidente, El Patron, all of these hats, you know, 500X, 100X, 1000X, Stetsons. They're all Stetson ranchers, essentially. Different modifications, you know, different blingy trim and stuff, different cases and certificates they come. And the felt is, you know, better as they go, as they grow more X's inside. And you, know, you will actually see, you know, they, they have like a hundred X's, like this whole area is covered in gold X's, you know. Um, they're great. I'm gonna say I prefer the 10X you know, 20x if I had some real money in the bank, I guess, you know. But uh, 10x to me is gorgeous, and I don't feel any need for people to go up higher unless, you know, they got, you know, they made their first million, they want to spend something on a nice, expensive piece of clothing, and they're really into it, you know, it's cool. Uh, I personally don't think that kind of uh, money should be spent on a hat unless you can afford it. It's like car money. Okay, the open road is kind of a crossover hat. It's a uh, the top of a western, but sh but shorter. It's a cattle crease, just like a s standard rancher, but it's lowered, and it's got a flanged snap brim, like a sort of a uh, a dress hat. You know, that's a small hat. It's a suit. I had to include this because it's super super trendy. They're even coming out with a beaver version next year, the pure pure uh, open road and pure straddle on Of course, they're so popular. Um, that's a great hat. The open road is a small western that's shrunken down. It's a dress western or something you can wear that's a lot smaller and not big and flamboyant. I think it's a great hat. Um, there's a couple of hats in their catalog to me that are just legendary that I think are, are incredible. Um, what else can I include there? Okay, I guess we're gonna have to see. If we have those two, let's put in the Gambler. The Royal Flush is definitely a classic. Um, we carry it in black, and we also carry it in like an off-white silver belly. They also make it in a chocolate brown too. So, there it is. The Royal Flush is right on the bottom there. Flat top like a pork pie. Silver conchos. Pencil curl, which is cool. You know, it's hard to get a hat with a pencil curl brim, sort of like a Homburg or something. Just curled on the edge, flat brim with a curl right on the edge. It's a gambler. Great felt. It's got a good amount of X's in it, so it's a decent felt. Comes in chocolate, silver belly, and black. The royal flush. Very nice pencil curl. Um, the Doom is something that's a hat that anybody can wear. A lady can wear this, a guy can wear it, a businessman can wear it, a young guy, an outdoorsman, a hippie can wear it, a rocker can wear it, uh, a dude from Nepal or Nep Tibet can wear it, a cowboy dude can wear it, a farmer can wear it, an executive can wear it, a regular old dude can wear it, anybody can wear this hat. It's rainproof, like crazy, good felt, like their answer to a Kubra, Stetson Dune, it's in the Gun Club collection. The Dune is like the classic. It comes in black, acorn like brown, and an off white color, silver belly. That is awesome. It's a flattish brim, very understated, just a little string straddle liner uh, band. Doesn't curl up on the sides like a you know, big western does. 